Hey everybody, a company called Cupaw, spelled Q-P-A-U, sent me this 12 watt LED grow light to try out, and that's what I'm going to do. Let me open this box up, and you can see how well it's packed. Little info sheet, and there's the light itself. Take that out, and it also has foam on the bottom. Now I've reviewed grow lights like this before. And here's one of them. I won't say what company, but that's how it came. It, there's no protection in there at all. So that's one good thing about this. They packed it well. And yeah, this is a 12 watt. It has um, three blue LEDs and uh, nine red LEDs. The blue's for uh, vegging and the uh, red is for flowering. So I thought to test it out, we give it a quick 10 day test because then I can tell how it's going to work. And the way I do that is I sprouted some beans in a napkin. And these are past due, but I put one in here as soon as the roots started to come out. And you can see there. The bean is just starting to pop out. So I'm going to call this day one and we're going to give this a 10 day trial and I'll know if the light is any good if the bean plant stretches thin, like really tall, or if it stays kind of squatty with leaves. So a good 10 day trial should do it. So this is day one and I'll show you the setup. Okay, as you can see this is why I have it set up just a few inches above the planter and there's the bean and you can see there's a blue three blues and then all the red and this is day one so let's see what happens overnight and I'm gonna keep the light on 16 hours a day and then off for eight hours at night so uh, let's see what happens here we are 24 hours later day two and as you can see the bean is just starting to get some leaves, so I bet those open up tomorrow on day three. 24 hours later, here we are, day number three. And let me zoom in here a bit. As you can see, leaves are taking shape. And uh, we'll wait for tomorrow, day number four. Here we are at day four. And the leaves are getting bigger. Here we are at day five, and as you can see, the leaves are getting bigger, and I'm expecting the next set of leaves to come out uh, probably tomorrow, so we'll see. Here we are at day six, and as you can see, the leaves are getting bigger, and we can see right here, the first set of true leaves are starting to come out. Here we are on day number eight. I skipped day seven because it looked just like day six. But today we see some growth in the middle with new leaves. A whole new set of leaves coming out. And uh, once those come out, this thing's going to really take off. And I'm really happy this plant is nice and short and not stretched out because I also planted over here. This is another bean plant that I had in the windowsill. And you can see how long and tall it is. It stretched out because it wasn't getting enough sunlight. But um, right now I, I just threw it under this uh, high powered LED. This is a 400 watt. Just to get it to go along with all my other plants here. I'm growing cotton. So uh, let's see what happens on day number nine. Here we are, day number nine. And you can see these leaves are really starting to come out now. Let me pull it out of the light here. You can see how nice and green that is. Here we are at day 10.5 I would say. It's a little bit late in the day. But as you can see, this thing is really starting to take off now. And let me turn it here. It's got this set of leaves and a new set coming out right there. And the plant is nice and short, so it didn't stretch out toward the light, which means the light is strong enough to support a plant of this size so far. But I am going to continue growing this. 
and do an update every two weeks or so and see if I can get it to go all the way to producing some green beans. And um, yeah, just uh, subscribe to Sleep Sacks Rule on YouTube and I'll keep you updated on how this goes. But for now, this is all I was going to test out and it seems to be working great. So uh, that's all. I hope you enjoyed this little test of these spotlights, as you can see. <laughs> anyway, I had fun doing it. Take care, everybody.